Good morning, friends, and welcome back to our little Oregon homestead. I could never settle down Too far away from my hometown So this past week we shared a property tour video with you, so if you haven't watched that, definitely go back and check that out. But today I just wanted to share something that's been on my mind the past few weeks. Since we've moved out here, I haven't really had the privilege and the joy of getting to walk out in the morning into a full garden. At the old house, I had a garden. It was a small garden and it didn't have a lot of space, but it was there and it was wonderful. And I've really been missing getting to walk out there and pick strawberries with Olivia. I've missed getting to see all my plants grow. I miss the sunflowers. I miss watching the pumpkins turn orange. And I just miss getting to see the work that I put in just really grow and develop. As we were doing the property tour video last week, it really kind of hit home that this is such a blank canvas for us right now. I mean, I'm standing in front of what's one day going to be my garden, but it's clearly not there yet. And that's hard to process. Then I started thinking a little about it a little bit more and over the past few weeks, some things have kind of been coming to light and have been really helping me work through it in my own heart. So basically in my last vlog, I shared how I full heartedly believe that God did bring us to this place. He did provide this, this home, this property for us. And what it comes down to is if I truly believe that, then I also have to believe that he has a plan for us here. And clearly I cannot see it but it is there and that's what walking by faith means knowing that there is a plan that you cannot see but trusting that you are moving in that direction so for me what that means is just doing the next right thing taking the next right step towards developing and growing and building this garden that I have in my heart and in my mind and trusting that because God does have a plan for us here that he will see it through and whether it takes this year whether it takes the next five years just have to trust that whatever the plan is it will come to light and it will come to completion and as hard as hard as it is sometimes to enjoy the process and enjoy the moment. That's really what I'm going to be focusing on in the coming weeks as I start to grow and develop what will be my garden space. So I just wanted to really just take this morning and encourage you if you're struggling in the moment that you're in, if you're struggling in the work that that's in front of you right now, just know that there is a bigger plan for you. There is more to the hard stuff that's going on right now. There's more to the work that you're putting in, the effort that you're putting in. There's a bigger plan in place and you will get there. I'm excited to see how this space will grow, how this space will start to form and progress into a garden, but I'm really gonna be focused on enjoying the process of it all too because really that's the only way that I'm going to get to enjoy the end goal. That's really the only way that I'm going to get to enjoy the finished product is by knowing the work and the time and the heart that I put into getting there. So this week we're bringing in our first lot of compost. Eventually we want to start our own compost piles here, but we're not there yet and we don't have the animals or the means to produce any compost yet. So we're bringing in a load of compost and it will be officially the start of my garden. And I could not be more excited about that because I think just maybe it'll be just in time to get some fall stuff planted and 
that makes me super happy. So all that just to say, there's a plan. Just keep moving forward, keep doing the next right thing and trust that there is something greater and better and wonderful waiting for you. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. And I will see you all next time.